Prep, prep the instruction for this video down below. Hey there folks, Peter here from BlackRock Business. Welcome back to the channel. Today in QuickBooks Point of Sale, we are going to talk about syncing your license data. And why would you want to do that? Well, syncing your license data is something you're going to need to do if you ever add an extra user to your QuickBooks Point of Sale license, or maybe several users. So, if your store is growing, and you feel the need to either grab a backroom inventory machine or maybe you need a second or a third register, you are going to need to add a user to your QuickBooks point of sale license. And guess how you can do that? Well, you can contact BlackRock Business or myself, Peter. Just let me know and we can get you the special pricing on doing that. Usually we have promotions going on where you're going to pay a fraction of the price to actually add a user to your current license, which is an excellent way to do it. Uh, I guess the big difference is you can go to Intuit and they get the whole pie or you can go to somebody like me who enjoys helping you use QuickBooks point of sale. I can also sell the user because I am a QuickBooks advanced solution provider so same pricing or better, except I get a little bit of the pie. I do appreciate that, folks. I enjoy helping you out, but I got to make a living too, you know? So anyways, hit me up and let me know if you need another user added to your license. So once you do get that user added to your license and it's all processed with Intuit and it's all set to go, you're going to come in your QuickBooks point of sale here and go on the help menu to manage my license and sync, sync license data online. Once you click that, it's gonna think for a moment and it's gonna tell you that your QuickBooks desktop point of sale license data was successfully synced with Intuit. And that is how Intuit servers let your computer know that it can have an additional user now and you can go install that on the other machine. You would be doing this on your QuickBooks point of sale server, by the way, if that was not already obvious. All right, so there you have it. That's how you sync your license data after adding a new user. My name's Peter with BlackRock Business. If this was helpful, go ahead and smash that like button. You have yourself an excellent evening. Bye-bye.